all right so we already have our day month year name of the day and name of the month now what we are going to do is that we are going to find out the day of the week well we already have the day of the week in the form of name here but we want the day of the week in the form of number like day one day two day three how do we do that let's start equals the formula name is week day weekday so if i write weekday the first argument that excel is asking me is serial number so instead of serial number i'm going here and i'm giving it date and now this argument is very important here and i want you to look at it closely so if i give one now excel will mean that my week is starting from sunday and it is going to saturday so sunday will be the day one and monday will be the day two and i don't want to do that I want Monday to be my day one and then going onwards. So what should be my argument? If I, if you look at the number two, it says the number one should be for the number one answer will be for Monday and through Sunday. Sunday will be the day seven. And that is what I want. So I will give the argument of two and I will press control enter to close this formula now. And you can see that Excel has given me the day of the week as one on Monday. Now I will just copy paste this to few cells below just to show you how it is working. And you can see that the days are moving onwards. On Saturday, it is day six. On Sunday, it is day seven. And on Monday again, it is again starting the week from day one and day two onwards. So what I will do now is that I will copy this formula. I will go down and paste this formula to all the cells below and this way you have the day of the week and now you can compare the day one of each week with day one of the other weeks and the other thing that we are going to do in this lecture is that we have to find out the week of the year so that we can again make an apple with apple comparison maybe we just need to compare the week 20 of 2019 with week 20 of 2020 or maybe we need to find compare the week 52 that is basically the christmas week of 2018 versus 2019 to versus 2020 so that way we can find out the particular week as well let's do that equals weekday week number basically not weekday sorry week number and press tab key and now the first thing excel is asking us is serial number so i will go give my date and the second thing is return type now again this is very important so excel is asking you that from which day your week starts so if i give it the argument of one which is by which is default as well by default i mean that if i just press the control enter now and close this formula excel will start my week from sunday and that is what i don't want i want excel to count my day starting from monday so i will give the argument of two and now I will press Control Enter, and you can see that Excel has given me that the first of January 2018 is my first week. And I will copy and paste this down here to few cells, and you can see that Excel is telling me that this is completely the first week going on. By the time the next week starts, that is again Monday. So up till Sunday, I mean up till 7th of the January, it was week one, and then Excel has started week two onwards. So I will copy this formula now, and go to the end and select all the cells and control v to paste so you can see that excel has given me the weeks for all the different dates here so you must be wondering perhaps that why the last week is 36 so basically if i can just uh, move it a bit uh, this is basically 2020 data is only available till august so you can see that august is actually the week th 31st of august is actually week 36 but if you can go back if i can show you 2018 data where 2018 is ending if i can just give me one second please here 2018 is ending 31st of december and this is basically week 52 is there and on 31st of december this is going to be week 53 uh, so this way you can actually uh, calculate the uh, week of the year as well i hope that was helpful